Alright, so we're gonna go check out the asteroid fields here. Hopefully it's slightly less popular than the previous system. We might have to just travel to a few more through a few more gates. So that was a star gate we traveled through. Oh, star map. Wanna see the star map? That's the star map. <laughs> we are here. Uh where are we? So we started in Amsen there. We are now there, and the the game world is that big. All the red stuff is now sec. All right, there's an asteroid. Good, good. There's an asteroid. All right, I'm gonna approach this guy. Oh, look at that! Actual asteroids, amazing. Oh, we need to orbit it, don't we? We're gonna orbit at uh, one one kilometer, and then we have to lock it. And then we go activate mining laser. Oh, okay. How far away are we? This thing has 10 kilometer range. And that thing is 20 kilometers away. Alright, fine. So you can see that other people are mining these rocks right now as well. Po Poxu Mineral Group Retriever. Poxu Mineral Group Retriever. Mind Drill Venture. So there's a bunch of um, there's a few corporations here working in the high sec area, mining ore, as you can see. All right, we're just going to do our thing here as well, and we're going to activate our mining laser once we get within range. Uh, wait for your mining laser cycle to finish at least three cycles. Right. Belt spar a basic type of ore, sure. So we are mining hard. And it tells you we've got 69 units of belt spar. So we are we are mining away, which is cool. I don't really wanna get that much stuff. Reprocessing service? What does that mean? Talking to the station using the reprocessing system by ranking the ore. Alright, so we're gonna go find a station. Corporation Factory. Matura Plantation. Mercantile Club. Uh, let me go to there and dock. Let me dock there. And see if we can refine. You don't smash into asteroids, by the way. Like the asteroids are just decoration. We'll see if we can reprocess at this station here. This one. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Cool, thank you. Uh, let's see. Industry? Install blueprint. This is not reprocessing. Wait a minute. This station... Alright, well this station does not have reprocessing. Services. That kind of sucks. I. Uh, okay, where, where's my. People and places. Um. Search and location create folder. That's not what I want, is it? Places. Can I search type any? Search type st station. Search. I can't just search? Okay, never mind. So let me just go to, uh, wait a minute. So system, station, and we need to figure out uh, reprocessing plant is not right. 
Which one has ore? Uh, wait a minute. Re wait a minute. No, no, this is reprocessing. Is that right? Hold on. So if I inventory the Veldspar? And if I go reprocess, oh, it's a reprocess. Except nothing's happening. Using the that can be accessed by right clicking on the ore. But it doesn't let me do anything. Oh, here it is. The window is. Wait, what? Why did the window not open? Uh, okay, so we're gonna reprocess that into that. Uh, 30% base yield, which is kind of bad. Times one, times one, times one. So if you have a better skill, then your yield improves, but our yield is pretty bad right now. We lose 70% of it. <laughs> okay. Alright, I'm gonna reprocess that one. Alright, do it. Cool. Next. So that's what you do to, if you want to mine asteroids, that's what you do, right? You get a ship, you go up, you shoot an asteroid with your laser, you, the, the ore appears into your inventory, you go to a station, you can sell the ore itself, or you can reprocess it and then sell the reprocess ore. The thing is, because our reprocessing skill is so low, it's probably better off that we sell the ore, because other people with a higher reprocessing percentage would be able to get more out of the ore and therefore they will pay more for it. So if we reprocess it and sell the uh, titanium that we get, we'll probably get less out of it than if we just sell the ore and let someone else get reprocess it because they get more titanium out of it so then they are able to pay more for the ore that they buy from us. So it's probably better off at this point that we just sell the ore. Uh, market forces. The market can be your road to great wealth and your portal to what you need. In the market, you can get better ships, more powerful modules, blueprints for production, or ore for processing. You can also sell stuff you have just mined, bought, looted, or traded. Eventually, you may be making many millions through the market. Let's liquidate some unneeded assets for hard cash. Alright, sure. Ah, the market. So everything in the market is actually other players. I don't think the game actually manufactures anything for you. So everything that exists in the game is made by other players. Either they, they kind of blow blow up uh, enemy ships and they loot it off them, or they manufacture them. They mine asteroids, get get minerals, and they manufacture things. So the whole market in the game is player-driven, which I think is kind of amazing. Alright, travel to the new star system, which we have. Selling your stuff. For an item to be sold, it must be in a station hangar. You should dock in a station. One stock inventory. Nothing found. Oh wait, why do I have that still? Alright, inventory, buying from the market, selling your stuff. So I'm gonna sell, sell this item. Actually, I'm just gonna see if anyone's buying this. Veldspar, view... Hmm. That guy... Is buying it for 14. I'm just gonna sell it immediately, I think. Uh, sell this item immediate. Uh, Alright, sell. Yes. Uh, try buying from the market. Let's acquire the social skill. A basic skill for improving agent relations. Open market icon. Search for social. Uh, hold on. So the... that's the wallet. Where's the market again? <laughs> the uh, uh, regional market. Skills. Now we need social. Skills, social... There are no... sellers nearby. Note that the skill should be 20,000 isk. Alright, good. So let me just see. Alright, no one's selling right here. Hmm. 
this match is one jump away. Alright, so we bought that. But does that appear in... It doesn't actually appear in our inventory, it's actually in the other station. So the station is, is one jump away, and it's actually in that station that we've, we've bought our thing. Uh, career agent, hold on, let me, before we do anything else, I'm just gonna take this... Ship hanger, I'm just gonna go... Um, so you look at the personal assets, for example. So we're there, Emson Social, oh it's actually back in our first station. So I'm going to go back, so I'm going to set this nation there. And I'm going to undock. Let me go back to our first station. And put our ore back where we stashed our other stuff. Alright, we're going to jump to there. Some of this stuff is not... It's not intuitive, is it? I mean, I only know this because I've played the game before. Like, the fact that you can buy things in a neighboring system, but it like it just goes into the... In, it goes to that station, it doesn't go to... <laughs> it doesn't go to you. So it appears in the warehouse of the station where you... where the thing you, you bought it is, but it's not where you are. So you can just spend money and buy stuff like two star systems away. And like your money's gone, but then like like where are you? I don't know where I am. I'm gonna dock there. Get back to that station. All right. So let's let's look at this. The next one, Korea agents. Your empire has established a network of agents throughout New Eden. These agents can be of great help to you. As a first step, you should contact one of your Korea agents. All right. Next. Uh, the database of Korea agents working with your school is available to you. Take a look at the fields the agents specialize in. Uh, business, exploration, industry, military, advanced military. Cool story. Docking permission requested. Docking request. Accepted. Yes, I want to close that. All right, so we're back here. I'm going to chuck that in the item hanger. I'm going to inject the skill. So you have to buy a skill box, you inject the skill and then you can start training it. So for example now if we look at our character and social, it says required skill book not injected, right? So you're not some of these things you have already, but other things like for example Katari Destroyer, you need to buy the skill book. And then you have to train the skill, right? So let me just inject the things that I need. Uh, uh, inject skill. Cool. I have uh, 64,000 isk worth of stuff, if you believe that. Opportunities. Uh, under the help menu. Career agents. Business? Exploration? Contact? Uh, let's go business. Set destination. Contact the career agent. Open a conversation working that field appeals to you. Start conversation. Wait, right click start conversation. So this is your... Please, sounds good, please drop by so we can formalize the mission contract. Alright, close. So these are NPCs, these are not people, right? So you can get missions from NPCs, and uh, this is your PvE version, your player versus environment version. Or like, the, this this kind of area of the game. Uh, Alright, good. I'm gonna go out there and autopilot. Eve Help, career agent. Career agents, they give you like a, a quest chain as well, I believe. 
and it's actually worthwhile to do them. Would you like me to suggest another opportunity? Sure, next. Your first mission. Career agent missions are a good start for an aspiring capsuleer making their way in New Eden. So we really want to go through all the career agents, and this is like the extended tutorial. Um, career agents provide useful guidance and rewards for a job well done. There are many agents out there and many other ways to build up your skills and assets as a pilot. Alright, good. Alright, so we're going to go to our career agents and do whatever they say. And we want to do all of these because they do give you some rather useful rewards for completing the tutorial. Man, I, I don't even remember what happened the first time I played. I think we got confused a little bit. The mining part of the tutorial is a bit confusing. Because in all of the starting systems, all the asteroids are gone. And so the game tells you, oh, go mine an asteroid. And you're like, what asteroids? There's no asteroids here. <laughs> so, uh... That part was confused. I remember that. But then you just kind of go to a neighboring system and get an asteroid. And then the other stuff is relatively straightforward. Oh, that's right, you get a bunch of ships too. By the time you're done, you have like five ships or something. Uh, did we get mail? Somebody sent us mail earlier, didn't they? Mulek Uno, join us. Just spamming, look at that. Complete spam. You seem to have what it takes. S-E-A-M. Proton Cryogenics Pty Limited. New bros wanted. Now come and prove it. Warping to Stargate. Warp drive active. So some people just randomly invite you into their corporations. Uh, people and places, contacts, or agents. So that's the... Alright, that's the business guy. Didn't somebody invite us into a corporation? Fleet corporation... Use corporation search. I don't want to... Directly invited, but like, who are these guys? Uh, show info. Bounty. 54 million isk bounty. War history. They've been involved in a number of wars already. Fun and friendly corp. Yeah, sure. Approaching Stargate. Classes on trading and mission running, even offer wages for our active members. 1 to 100 mil depending on how active you are and how much of contribution you're making. In corp mining foreman for higher bonus yield. 11 people. The corp has 11 people. 5% tax rate, standings are neutral, alliance history, nothing. Uh, wait, when are they founded? They're about a year old, and they're still hanging around trying to recruit newbies. So I don't, I don't even know if, if uh, let's just say these guys are not. Uh, they're they're not uh, the pros in this game. <laughs> they're hanging around starting areas. Trying to hire newbies. Alright, dark there. Warping to station. Autopilot disabled. Warp drive active. I do have my own ideas about where I want to go and what I want to do. Uh, we're going to Providence. But uh, you're not going to, unless you, you play Eve, you have no idea what that means. We're going down south to Providence because I like those guys. But uh, we'll talk about that later. For now, let's just do these tutorials. 
Booking permission requested. So these numbers, their security status, see that? 0 0.9. So anything Stop from 1.0 to 0 0.5 is high security. High security, if somebody tries to kill you, then there's NPCs that will respond. They're called Concord. So, so the higher the security, the faster they respond. And these are just over, completely overpowered AI NPC ships that will just come and destroy whoever is trying to kill you. So whoever breaks the law and tries to kill people, the Concord will come along and, and kill them, unless they run away. But from 0 0.4 down to 0 0.1 is low sec. There's still defenses at the Stargates and at the stations, but then Concord does not respond. So if you're out in an asteroid field and somebody comes and ganks you, uh, nobody responds. Or the, 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 the game doesn't respond. And then in low sec, there's just no, there's no one except players. So players can have stations, and uh, but but there's no there's no NPCs out there. And in most parts of Nosec, which is like 0, 0.0 is Nosec, in most parts of Nosec, it's they shoot on sight. So if if you're not if they don't know who you are, they just kill you. They just blow you up immediately. So uh, Nosec is let's say you need to make friends before you go there. You don't go there and then make friends. You have to make friends before you go there. Otherwise, you just get blown up. Providence is different. Providence is not red, don't shoot. Which means that um, unless they know you're a bad guy, they won't shoot you. So it's, it's more complex for them because they have to check your name against their database to see if, if you're one of the people who have messed around with them before. But if you're neutral and, and they don't know who you are, they don't shoot you on sight down there, which is kind of crazy. Considering that there's a lot of pirates in this game. Anyway, we, 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 we'll, we'll meet those guys later on, pirates, that is. So, we talked to him first, right? Let me go to my people and places and agents and talk to this guy.